In this video, I will show you how you can create an RTP for free. You don't need anything, you don't need to put in your credit card or debit card details. You just need a Google account and you'll be good to go. So first of all, you need to get to this website called console.google.com, console.cloud.google.com. The link to this website will be in the description below or you can just go to Google and search for Google Cloud. And when you click on the first link, you get to an interface like this or you get to an interface uh, like you get to the previous page where you get to see a console option over here. You just need to click on the console option. It's written console. You can click on it and you will get to this page. So as soon as you get to this page, you need to click on this activate cloud shell option. Let me just zoom in for you. This is the activate cloud shell icon. Just click on it and the cloud shell will be activated for you. So now you can see this is the cloud shell. You just need to copy paste a command from the description. So this is the command. This command is given in the description below. You can just copy paste it. And what we are going to do over here is what the command does is you just uh, running a Docker container, Docker image of Ubuntu. So we are going to be installing Ubuntu uh, operating system, Ubuntu system over here using Docker. So copy paste this command in Google Cloud Console and hit enter. And it will take some time to download the Ubuntu image from the internet and then you can use it. So it will take some time to download. Let's just wait for the download to complete. Okay, so now you can see it is live and we can uh, open it on web. So what we can do is we can click on this option called web preview and then there are three options over here preview on port 8080 or change port or learn more about web preview so what we are going to do is we are going to click on change port all right so now let's come to another tab and paste this command over here so the port we used or the port we have specified in the docker command is 6070 so this is the command right this is the port so what we need to do is we need to copy this copy this port and paste it in this port number option copy paste 6070 and hit on and click on change and preview so as soon as you click on change and preview it opens up on a new tab and it will take some time for the ubuntu system to load up and your virtual or or your rdp remote desktop protocol will be ready so now as you can see as you can see it is ready almost ready all right so now it is ready you can click on this and you can see on internet you have three browsers over here firefox google chrome and google chrome sound and this server and on system tools you get this file manager and terminal on preference you can customize this entire look of the desktop so what what we are going to do over here is we we are going to open up a browser and uh, Let's search for internet speed. So it is lagging a bit, but it takes time to like. So as you can see, this uh, I think this server is located on China or something. So you need to change it to English. So just click on run speed test around 600 MB per second. So it's very high. This is the download Mbps around 985 Mbps download and upload this. 1655 Your, uh, this server is located in Taipei Taipei I don't know how to pronounce it I think it is in China let's just search what is my IP so it is not showing me any IP over here let's just click on this so this is the IP and again it is located in I think China or somewhere doesn't matter so the point is your RDP is ready and you can use it for free so this is all about today's video. Please do like and share this video and subscribe to this channel for more videos like this.